Sitting down to figure out what I was going to say about Deterion, I first knew that I had to eliminate his middle name, so Ms. Fletcher's on the, his list right now because she put it in the program. Um, and it's on the big screen behind him, so I'm sure he's thrilled. Um, but I was sitting down to make a list of, of what I admired about Deterion and what made him the perfect candidate for the Personal Initiative Award. And I started by writing, obviously, his ac athletic accomplishments. And if you noticed in the hallway, his face is plastered right outside one of these doors because Deterion's um, football accomplishments earned him that spot. So number 90 on the one of the big, huge posters out in the hallway is Deterion. Um, Deterion had an almost undefeated wrestling season this year that ended him a third place um, state competition finalist. Since when? <laughs> Whatever. Um, and just a couple of weeks ago, and he'll be embarrassed that I'm saying this, he set, what's that called, the deadlift record? It's apparently some real big thing, you know, where you lift up the bar and it's got a lot of weights on it. He set that record. Um, I could talk about his academic accomplishments. Um, he carries a 3.2, and every time his grade in my class drops from a 90 to an 89, I get an email saying, what can I do to bring it back up? Um, I could talk about his work ethic and the fact that outside of school and his numerous athletic events, he still carries an almost full-time job at Longboards here in Liberty. I could talk about his heart for others, the fact that he's managed to keep a pretty awesome girl, Whitney, around for three years, and also calls to check in with his mom periodically during my class. Um, but what I think is fairly unique about Deterion is not only his accomplishments, but his modesty and humility. Um, what was impressive today, actually, we were mentioning tonight, and he was talking about the ratty shirt he was going to wear, and we were convincing him that he wouldn't be wearing that. But um, one of the things that um, another student in class said, they said, you are totally, um, totally one of those kids who should get one of those awards. And Deterion really quickly responded and said, oh, they're better kids than me. And that's kind of his attitude. You know, when they lost a football game and, you know, I'd ask him, are you disappointed? You know, is today going to be a bad day? It's just a game. You know, when he lost his big, I mean, I think he went 41-0 and before he lost one. Is that right? And on that 42nd one, didn't phase him a bit. Guy must have just been better than him. Came back from state. Didn't phase him a bit, must have just wrestled somebody who was better than him. That humility and modesty is what sets him apart from his peers. Usually someone with a huge personal initiative, initiative who accomplishes as much as Deterion has in his short three years of high school, I'd like to brag about it. I mean, his face is all over the Liberty Tribune, and I'm sure that that'll be the same as senior year. But I've never seen Deterion necessarily pat himself on the back. Instead, he gives kudos to the people around him, which is what sets him apart from others. So he is 100% deserving of this award, not only for his personal initiative, but also for his modesty.